G'day legends, we're um, just down at Port Vincent today. The, the wind is blowing a little bit, but uh, the uh, west eastern side, sorry, of the York Peninsula is doing okay. I bought these new 1.75 inch micro fry shads from Z-Man. Uh, just wanted to give them a go. We'll move fairly quickly up the beach and see if we can catch maybe some flatties. Who knows, there might be some salmon trout around. Um, so yeah, no bait today, just plastic. So we'll see if we can catch some fish uh, with just the soft plastics today, bit of a challenge. Well, we've given this uh, micro or fry, uh, shad fry Z, a bit of a go. I had a couple of tiny nibbles, but nothing that I would uh, want to write home about. So I'm going to throw him back in the packet. This is the uh, new chicken, I think, or the electric chicken. Uh, it's got the UV, I believe. We've got quite a few different styles of these ones, or colours. They've got quite a few of different ones of these. I bought um, five different ones. I've got the uh, uh, the straight pearl, the uh, the blue glimmer, the grey see-through smelt, as well as the um, the more brighter fire truce. Um, might, given the water is so clear, um, might go for something that's a little bit more natural looking in the smelt. Um, and see if we get any action on that one. These shad uh, fries, I'm probably a bit too early, not uh, not to be uh, uh, yeah, the person that criticises the tackle, but because it's obviously the fisherman, uh, but I'm not really getting any interest whatsoever. They might actually be, I don't know, I was going to say too small, but I've seen, uh, I've seen the tackle tactic guys catch some uh, good size flatties on them. We've got some serious weather moving across so I might actually head down towards the next um, if I can get there in time. Head down uh, with the serious weather coming in and it's coming pretty fast. I'm gonna head down to the next rotunda and hopefully um, it's only a quick shower and it, we can uh, still get some fishing done. Definitely getting a um, few nibbles here. some weed on that now. Yeah. Well g'day guys, um, the beach, <laughs> the beach and the soft plastics weren't proving any uh, success. Um, so I said no bait, still no bait, um, but we're going to try and catch a squid off the Port Vincent wharf here. It's very, very calm. Um, the water's quite, looks quite dark. It's overcast. See how we go. If it's good out there, we should be right to get a couple for dinner. I think I saw some snook down there. So we're going to uh, grab the uh, the nuke chicken. It's off plastic. And see if we can't get some. Oh, no. Here we go. So yeah, the nuke chicken. I'm going to put him on a slightly bigger hook. Not that big. Yeah, probably a three o. Quarter ounce. Yeah, just saw that larger third of the way down that profile. Almost chasing the squid jag. And I haven't done this very well, I'm gonna have to do it again. Straight on, Matty. Up. Don't twist. Why do they twist? Tell me, people, why do they twist? Why do they naturally seem to want to twist? Get some, uh, get some S-Factor scent on that. And I like these because I've got this big cavity underneath. Let's see how we go, guys. I've seen sort of swimming just along the wharf, so I'm gonna do that, cast along the wharf and then twitch it back. Oh, she stands out in the water. Uh, try back out where we did with the squid jag. Be great to hook up to something. Oh, something's just behind it. Oh, that's a squid. Uh, well, that's annoying. If they like the, uh, if they like the, if the squid like the new chicken plastic, might have to change it over to the uh, Glow Tiger jig, squid jig. Oh, I haven't seen this fish since. Must have just swum through. They normally sort of seem to hang around a bit. Give it one more cast and then we'll try the Glow Tiger squid jig. Oh, in fact, we're going to do it now because we can see that thing hanging around down there and oh, I'm sorry I just can't leave a squid there not to be caught <laughs> oh, 
In fact, I'm not going to worry about the glow tiger. I'm just going to put the red on because the glow tiger's still in the packet. Come on. I know he's down there. He's, uh, there he is. He's right next to it. He needs to actually grab it with the... He's coming in behind it, I think. No, I haven't done. Something behind my squid jig, but it's not a squid. Something raced up to it. But there was a squid down here, but might have to change colours. He liked my glow chicken soft plastic. So I put this one on because I had it out, but I'll grab the glowy. But it looks like there's a bit of action down there. Well, we finally got him. Just a baby. Do you want him for bait? No, not that small. Okay. If you want to use him for bait. Yeah, yeah, if you don't want him, I'll use him as bait. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, whatever. I mean, you're gonna get, not going to get much food off him. <laughs> I could actually see them, sw see the Tommy swimming around. Got one? Tiny. Lots of babies out today. Oh, he jumped off. So we've gone a bit full circle now. Um, I've seen some small Tommies down there as well as some salmon. The salmon turned around for the larger new chicken five inch but didn't take it. So going back to the, um, the 1.75 shads, I had a couple of little tiny pulls on a two and a half inch split tail. We'll see if this uh, fry, uh, fret, uh, and it's in the, um, what color? It's in the blue glimmer sparkle, so it's almost a bit pilchardy, baby pilchardy looking. We'll see if that gets some uh, action for us. It's just on a um, 1 12th UV jig head, 2 I think, giving it a couple of flicks across the bottom. There's definitely some fish around, it's just uh, whether we can get them to bite. Caught a tiny baby squid, I think you might have seen that. And yeah, sorry, not really doing what I said I was going to do today, I just, uh, that beach session just didn't really seem to yield any results, not even bites, so I thought maybe a bit too early for that. Oh, we've got a uh, dolphin, which is always a good sign, means there's fish around. <laughs> Had a couple of tiny inquiries here, not sure what that is, whether it's Tommy's or whatever, but uh, yeah, dolphin out there, I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, I think it's just baby Tommy's. Uh, he, uh, he's all a bit wrapped up there now. Got his tail around his uh, and Tommy is, uh, I think it's just a Tommy, just felt like a Tommy. Oh, he's going on here. Okay, nice and straight again. Not too far out. About there. It'd be nice just to catch a fish for you guys. I mean, um, this is a bit of a, I think we've got some action here on the drop. Nope. Oh, haven't got quite the lightest rod that I normally have, but I was hoping to catch a decent size, getting tiny little bites. I was hoping to catch a decent size flathead, didn't eventuate. Oh. And that's being pulled off the jig head, which you can see. So there's definitely some stuff interested in it, which is good. But they actually need to gobble it up. We might uh, just flick it out and uh, along the jetty and just do a slow retrieve. Give it some time to sink. Just slowly retrieve it and see if we get any interest. There's definitely some fish out here. You can see ripples in the water and stuff. Might be a bit spooked after that dolphin came through. Get me excited when you hear that noise. We finally caught something on a soft plastic today. A fish, I mean, or on a soft plastic, because the other one was on a squid jig. Uh, yeah, going back. It's tough going. But hey, we're out here. The weather has calmed down immensely. It's, um, it's not even um, really blowing at all now, which is great. And really all we've got out here is a few tommies, but I'm hoping that we can... Uh, you know, find something else, maybe snook or reasonable salmon. You can see ripples in the water and stuff. There's definitely fish out there. As I say that, it starts to blow again. Might, uh, might switch over to a larger minnow paddle tail. See if we can get some action. Uh, we've moved from the jetty, lots of little fish. Nothing really biting there. So we're back here. Yes, you know the spot if you saw my previous Port Vincent video. We're at the end of the break wall. We're gonna try and catch a couple of squid. And then we might put the soft plastic on to see if we can get some 
um, snook. Not sure how big it is, but we finally caught a squid. So we've been trying lots of things and we finally got a little squid. Hopefully we can get two or three more before it gets too dark. But um, yeah, we've got something to eat. And we've just got another one. I was about to say last cast. <laughs> the light's gone down pretty much. I'm not sure. This feels a bit bigger than the last one. Oh, we've got him by one candle. I have enough for dinner. Oh well, the light is really bad. I've actually got the interior lights of the car and that's still not enough. Um, but yeah, that's the litre of the 20 litre drug. <laughs> yeah, you can't see that. A couple of squid. We'll see you next time. Thanks guys.